Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Finally gonna start planting some soybeans. Gonna get the planter loaded up and get on my way. So the planter is full. I'm gonna put a bottle of this in. It is inoculant. Close the lids and we're gonna start planting. So heading off to the field, gonna get GPS to load. Gotta turn the monitor on. So let's go head to the field. Sorry I haven't been making videos lately. Been plenty busy. I was over at the neighboring farm. We were chopping triticale last week and I'm hauling manure and I was planting. Today we were over there chopping alfalfa. So I don't know what time it is now. It's about 6 30. I wanted to get started planting for a little bit here tonight. Hopefully be able to plant corn end of the week. So sorry about that, but that's how farming goes. But this week we're gonna chop, so I'm gonna make a chopping video. Dave's probably gonna have the camera a lot for that because I'm gonna be over at the neighboring farm. We're gonna be chopping for a guy. So, but spring's here, full swing. We've been busy. We're getting there. We got probably got a day or two of corn planting to do, and it'll be at. Went through a waterway. You don't want to plant through them, waste of seed. But we're planting one kind of variety of soybeans so that makes it easy. I could just go to a field and start planting and not have to worry about that. Um, corn, we have three different varieties. I'll go over more of that, plant corn here under the week. But the variety is mainly like a kind of corn, like we got some bags of wetland corn for fields to, for, to put in fields that are wet and chopping corn for corn we're going to chop but i'll go over more in depth of that when when we're planting that here into the week but i want to run here for a little bit tonight and maybe get a field or two done uh, i got a quarter of death i should have filled that up but we'll get, we have enough for tonight i'm gonna knock these end rows out quick i hate planting end rows I like plant big long ones. But what are you gonna do? There's the end of a field. We don't have that many to do. And just go back and forth on the end a few times. And plant. This tractor likes to beep. So another way to tell where you're going on this planter, there's a chain there. You drag it on your the row you just planted. Drag it on the row you just planted, and it plants 15 inches apart. What you want for the soybeans? We can just look at GPS. That's the way I like to. I had to get out. I thought I seen something wrapped up in one of my closing wheels. It's just a piece of grass, pump of dirt. I want to keep them clean.
they're using either the Dome or how planner works um, from my video the GoPro outside. Those front spiky wheels are the road cleaners. They'll kick any debris out of the way, rocks, dirt clumps, you know, just junk. And then you got your two discs. They're kind of, they come, they're pretty much together on the one end and they're further apart of the, on the back. It makes the seed trench like a V down in and it drops the seed in. And then you got the seed firmer that pushes on the seed so it's good soil to seed contact. Then you got your closing wheels. Um, I'll show you all those parts here when I get out at some point, either today or whenever I plan again. But that's pretty much how a planter works. It's pretty, it's pretty simple. They may look confusing and big, and wires and hoses everywhere, but that's how a planter works. Well, the GPS isn't working. I'm riding the struggle bus tonight. Playing with that GPS, man, I'll tell you what. I don't know how they did it in the old days. But we shall suffer through. Man, come on. I think that bearing's out. Purpose, just so I can keep running. I'm just gonna take these road cleaners off. Back in the planner. Got the freaking road cleaners in here. That's a tomorrow project. We'll put a new bearing in and we'll be good as new. But planting away. This might be my last field for the evening, but we'll see what happens. So I'm kind of shooting for 165,000 for the population. Uh, running 166. I mean, it's, it's all right. We'll be all right. Our pioneer dealer, he's a good guy. We run out of seed, we give him a call. He's got more seed for us right away. So, sure can't complain. Pioneer is where it's at for around here. Can't see. It's so bright. It's some nice dirt, look at that. Oh yeah. About two weeks, they'll be popping out of the ground. Ready to see it. pass for the evening here which is good I'm hungry ready to be done for the day because we'll be back on this tomorrow evening maybe so, supposed to be running the merger tomorrow I won't get no footage of that it's not not over here I'll be busy maybe if I do merge over here in the next few days I'll get some footage but yep till the next day and we're back. It is the next morning. Planting soybeans. So here in our farm, we do all no-till. We've got a, it's a cover crop in this field. It's kind of spotty. We killed it off there so we could plant. But yeah, we got a bunch of hills, so no-till works good. So the dirt don't wash away. Um, we're in a program for the cover crop, so it works out good too. Corky got a new bearing in that road cleaner this morning, so which is good. I didn't want to plant these fields without road cleaners. There's a lot of junk in them. I mean, you can see all the grass and the old corn stalks. And so we're back in business with that. It was like I just forgot to share that earlier, but GPS isn't working right today, so. Yeah, we're eyeballing it. I think it'll be all right. It's just soybeans, it's not, you don't gotta be 100% because the combine will get them no matter what, really, so. 
We're planting. Good view from up here. This is our lower farm. There's the main farm up there. But getting this field opened up, I want to go around it four times, so I got plenty of room to turn around. This field, it kind of sucks. It's a pretty big field. It's not square, and it's on a pretty steep hill. So, but that's why we use overpower tractors for the piece of equipment, so you don't have any issues. So this planter is a Kinsey 3500 six row planter with inner plant. The plant soybeans really good. It, um, it folds up for transport. I'll uh, show you that when I leave the field to go back. Uh, it's pretty pretty sweet planter. It's got a monitor with it. it. Tells you everything you need to know. So that's what it is. There goes my seed tender, David Lyons. You bring me snacks? Bring me food? Yeah. That's good, I'm hungry. Back at the bean planter now. I quit around, I don't know, 12.30. Had to go merge. It is six o'clock right now. I got six acres left, and then the beans are done. So, I got a rider. She brought me food, I was pretty hungry. So, I got some videos from us chopping the past few days, just like ones I took with my phone. So, I'll throw them in the end of this video. They're not the greatest, but I thought I'd just show you what we've been doing. So, so we're done planting beans. Time to fold the planter up. First, I got to pick it. I, there's a pin, and I took the pin out. Pick it the whole way up. Then it spins. And it latches on that latch there with this little piece coming up. I'm gonna jump back out and put that pin in. Gotta fish my way through the throw units here, put the pin in. This goes in this hole so the planter can't come down. I got this. Put it on this side. Okay. Pin's tight. But while I'm out here, so this is a row cleaner. It kicks the junk out of the row. These are the two discs I was saying about. See how they place, and then they get wider. And the seed drops down. This is the seed firmer, it pushes down on the seed when you're going through the row. And then these are the closing wheels, push the dirt together, and find the row. And this is what you got right here. Dirt's all pushed on top of the seed. But planting is done. So I just got the bean plant done. Dave's gonna be mowing hay tomorrow, so I'm gonna give him the camera. So, chopping video coming next. That's the end of this video. Thanks for watching. Chopping. Another day of chopping. Spread manure. Chopping. <laughs>